So we are back and we are about to go into Diamond City Market to get the ring. Um, here we are. So this is the famous Diamond City. I suppose I have to find more of a gem than a dusty home base. Civilization in the rough. Hmm. I gotta get you a hat. I keep forgetting about getting this hat. Hold on, we sound. So the ring is here in this little box. Okay, I'm gonna have to jump out of my power armor. So we'll drop it there a second. Take the fusion core. So we'll leave it there a second. Um, So there's the ring on. Now in here you actually have uh gives you mod XP. So we've just drunk one of them and and basically what it means is you're not gonna ow burn through your XP as much. Don't drop down the way I do, you'll end up with broken bones. So, here's the ring. It's quite cool. I can actually get up here and see what's going on up here. This will probably save me a lot of hassle. I have no idea if we can use it in our power armor. So, because I always have my uh, medical, my, me my medic, my vault medical thing. So. We'll go outside before we actually try, because the last thing I want to do is turn everybody in Diamond City against me. So, let's see. Apparel. Yep, yeah, it's the lawn, so... The last one thing we want is everybody here getting angry and shooting us for dropping down on top of them. <laughs> I'm not used to the jetpack. I've only ever used a jetpack once before, and it was in Nuka whenever I decided to go up the side of the mountain to see what was there. So <laughs> I'm not very uh, adept at using the jetpack. Diamond City will let us back out again. Okay. Uh, where can we go? Um, what have we got on the map? It isn't going to turn everybody on us. Uh, But turn everybody on us. Yeah, well, why not use Concord? If we turn raiders on us, we really don't care. Raiders are going to kill us anyway. No. 
all we're jump all we're doing is jumping in our power armor so that's nice, pity an idea to try not to kill myself I was wondering what was up here. Or how he actually managed to get onto this flat roof. Can you tell I'm like a kid with a new toy, people? <laughs> this will make my life so much easier. If I wasn't so addicted, well, I, I, I can always get myself um, protective gear, like, but I'll need an auto inject stem pack of some type. As I said, it's me. There's a 99% chance I will likely injure myself pretty badly. As you see, <laughs> I just keep injuring myself. I think I got a lot of stems. Well, I would definitely say it's worth... Oh, okay. Apparently I found a station. Ah, is that it? Uh, civic access? Uh, oh, there. <laughs> yeah, a bit simple. That's the subway mod that we actually have downloaded that we'll have to get finished off as well. So... I would definitely say it's it's worth it's worth getting um, if you're you know if you're not a big power armor person um, and you know me I I sort of got a bit addicted to power armor which is a bit disturbing because in three and New Vegas I never touched the stuff absolutely despised it. And I've got madly addicted to power armor now, so... Well, he certainly doesn't need that anymore. Once I sort of get myself a bit of protective gear, and I know I actually can get stuff with auto-inject stems, um, I would say yes, you will find me using it quite a lot. Yes. It's the auto-inject stem that I'm actually finding handy, and it's literally for the simple fact that I keep forgetting to heal. That's all there is to it, is I keep forgetting to heal. Um, so, 
Yep, definitely. A, it's, a, it's a half decent little mod, and these little drinks are are definitely much appreciated because it it, it would burn through your sort of your uh, your AP. So yeah, well, I'm away here. I'm going to go and download a couple of more uh, settlement decoration type of things. So I shall catch us all later, peeps. Um, stay safe and have fun.